Hi, I'm Dr. Papia Bhattacharji. In this problem, we have an exponential equation. It is e to the power x plus 2 is equal to 8. And we have to solve for x. Now, how do we solve for x given an equation? Well, we want the x, that variable, to be on one side and everything else on the other side. Usually that's how we solve, right, in an equation. But here, the difficulty is the x, the variable, is in the exponent. It's not sitting as a linear form. So in order to solve for it, we have to first bring the x down from the exponent. Otherwise, we can't solve it. Otherwise, we can't make x free of everything else. It is sitting on the, on the exponent. So how do we do that? Notice that this is an exponential function. And we also know that the natural logarithm function is the inverse to the exponential function. So maybe we can apply some properties, the inverse property, to solve this problem. So let me first remind you of the inverse properties. of natural log and the exponential function. And the property says that whenever you have natural log of e to the power u, so notice that ln is a function and e is another function and they're inverse to each other. And the, in mathematical term, that means that these two functions cancel each other when they're sitting next to each other. And by canceling, I mean that whenever you're applying ln of e to the u, your final answer is just that u. So the ln and e almost like cancels each other. So come back here, and we can use this property right here to bring our x down from the exponent. That's what we're going to do. So let us apply this natural log function both sides of the equation. So when we do that, we are applying natural log on the left hand side, so we get ln of e to the x plus 2 on the left, and we also have to apply ln to the right side. So we get equal to ln of 8. Now we want to use this inverse property, and look, the left hand side of this equation look just like the property right here. And this x plus 2 is our u. So as soon as ln and e are next to each other, they cancel, like in the property, and we will have just the x plus 2 to the left. And right hand side, we will still have ln of 8. Now notice that the variable x is not in the exponent anymore. It is in a linear form, and so we can solve. So just subtract 2 from both sides, and we get x is equal to ln of 8 minus 2. And that is the solution to the given equation. Thank you.